тут. Да. А. I am Metlaranus. You would speak of me as a canine entity. Hello, welcome. Welcome. Well, I, thank welcome. you. Why do you want to speak to me? Nitrous did. Nitrous. Speak Hello. To me. Hello. What did you say your name was? Metrolamus. Um, oh, it would be pronounced here. What do you uh, look like? I do not know how to describe myself to you, but I am a large being in your terms. Muscular. I am bipedal, is that the word? Yes. Bipedal. We came from quadrupedal centuries ago. I have the head of, it looks like more like a wolf on your planet, I would think. Or a dog, some dogs, dogs. K9, dark colors. Of course, there is all colors of canines. What else do you want to know? Um. My features are. We do not have hair all over the body like your canines anymore. We have come past that. We still have hair on on the head, on the whole head. Hmm. Um, I have a soulmate who is a canine being. Are you from her uh, planet? What is her name? Well. She says that her name is Delilah because her actual name would not, I would not be able to pronounce it. She is from a neighboring planet. We have a few. Yes. Deliantasaka is her name. Deliantasaka. Deliantasa. I can't even pronounce it anymore. Your language. Delian Tasaka. Delian Tasaka. Oh, yes, thank you. So you said you're muscular. Do you mean like a werewolf? Let me investigate that term. Ha! Ah. A f fictional animal. No. Yes. But not quite the same. But yes, in some ways. Mm. Well, um, well I, I've been um, integrating energies with me, and I've been wondering that asking questions to myself about if I am to be a conduit for the canine energies because I have a but because I have much connections with that energy one moment let me connect with you 
Open yourself, please. You have more than canine energy. There is much animal energy within you. Interesting. Continue. Um, what is your message to humanity? You called me. I had no message for you. I wanted to see what you were about. We do not have people around your planet yet. I have a question if I could ask it. Certainly. Yeah, so, um, hello, nice to meet you, Metrolamus. I guess my question was, I w I'm fascinated by Egyptian culture and uh, yes. Nubis big deity in ancient Egyptian religion. So I'm curious what role uh, your race or canine races had with ancient Egypt. Yeah. We were there, yes. You see us on their walls. Anubis. So is that a good is that a good approximation of what you physically look like? Or is it is it actually quite different? <laughs> it is similar. The head is smaller now. Okay. It is getting smaller, but not much yet. It is similar. What role did you play in, in their culture? We took care of the dead. Okay. We, our beliefs at those times were that we could help them get to the new world in a different way than they had ever thought before. And we were successful because their ideas and thoughts about how to get to the new, the oversoul, were not as successful. Now, when a person is leaving their body, yes, it is true that they will go to the oversoul. We made the experience a little bit more attractive. Does that make sense to you? Yes. We brought it to you. We brought their uh, thoughts of spirituality into a greater realm by using pictures and ideas to move them into a more positive idea of what the next life would be. Because, of course, no one knew what it was until you get there. We have a greater understanding of that now. But our way was helpful to them because they felt comforted because before us they did not believe in an afterlife. They felt that they just were non-existent. But we brought them pictures and understanding of what the next life would be like. We were not always correct, I am sure, but it gave them more comfort. So, what's your uh, uh, culture like? The Aka. Our culture. The word culture, yes. That is our societal makeup. Is somewhat communal. It is what it is, but what I have to explain is that humanity lives like we live in some ways, but we have more control of our society than you have on your. Our society is not so opinionated. Is that the right word? And controlling. We let live a little more easily. 
I'm not sure how I to describe it. Do you understand me, or am I using bad words? Yes, we understand you. I am not familiar with your language as much as I should be to do a communication. It's, it's fine. You're coming across very well. We're understanding what you're expressing. I am uh, slightly uncomfortable. Do you have a question? Yes. How do you connect with all that is? All that is. No. What, what's a, a, main, a main part of your spirituality? Oh, spirituality. Our gods are the same as yours, except we put different faces on them than you put on your gods, of course. But they do the same things. They work the same ways. And they give us the comfort that we need for moving through our lives and knowledge and understanding. Does that make sense to you? I am a family person. I believe family is when you have children and equivalent other partner. Is that the way to say it? I am a spiritual person as well as my family. We go to places to give honor to our gods. We believe they are helpful and loving. I feel like I am not speaking well. Speaking very well. Thank you. You're doing a beautiful job. Thank you. We are simply listening. We hear you. We are quiet because we are listening to you. Thank you. I have a quick question, if that's okay. I was curious, what density are you in, and how old are you on your planet? What the lifespan is of your race? We are actually third density like yourselves. But some of us move to fourth density. We can live in the fourth density as well. But I prefer third density. And what is the lifespan of your race? On Earth, it's usually 80 to 100 is the maximum. Our lifespan is not long. It is very similar to yours. 80 to 110. OK. Um, you said that Delian Tasaka was on a neighboring planet. Um, are you able to give me the name of the planet? The name of the planet. Ah. Yes. The name of the planet is Tor. 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 I do not know the spelling, just the pronunciation for your world. Do you have approximate location with respect to Earth? I do not know where I am. I was called and Delilah knows this information, but I do not. Sir? Oh, oh, I thought you were done. Sorry, mm -hmm. Pegasus. Well, I have one more. Um, so, I like two more questions. Um, what is your role in your society? 
I'm a guardian. I guard those that have the power to rule. And I also guard those who cannot guard themselves. Oh, you still have the need for guardians on your planet? Yes. Oh, and are there any uh, uh, humans on your world? Would, 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 would an Earth human be able to come and visit your world? Yes, but there are none there now that I know of. I'd I like to volunteer. I was caught off guard by your question. But you may visit. I have no problem. Prepared to be smelled. Oh, that's fine. Delilah smells me all the time. But yeah, you just brought up a new question for me. Smelling. You smell others? Yes. Uh, she is saying that that is a form of getting to know people. Yes. Smelling you lets me know your fears and your understandings of social graces because your reaction to my smelling you will let me know how you feel about my community and my family. Oh well, um, I wouldn't mind that at all. It also tells me many other things. What part of the world you come from, your location from birth, and where you live now, because they all have distinctive smells. Are you able to smell me now? No. Okay, I have no more questions. Thank you. I will go then. <clears throat> oh wait, um, there I is think, one uh, more question, if you can. Okay. Yes. Hello, my name is Shu. Can name you hear is, me? What is your name? Shu. Yes, I hear you. You said that you prefer to live on the third density. Can you explain yeah. why not going to the fourth? Third density brings me much more senses, sensory, sensory adaptions. Fourth dimension is wonderful. Do not misunderstand. I prefer the more primitive dimension because I'm more adapted to it. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Love. What is love? Yes, I understand. Thank you. Thank you very much. Love and I thank you for answering our questions and coming. Many touches and smells to you. Oh, wait, uh, can I ask one more Same before you to you. Yes. Well, where, do you, where would you uh, smell us? I smell everywhere. I do not find one location to smell. Because there are many locations. Once I get to know you better, I will smell you more often. Okay, um, one more. How tall are you? Are your are your uh, people? I am six foot four inches in your dimension. 
we do understand numbers very well. Did I answer that correctly? Yes, you answered fine. Um, thank you, and I would like to see you sometime, and I have nothing else to say. Thank you for visiting us. We appreciate it. And for you to come in and answer Pegasus questions. Many touches and smells to you. Many touches and smell to you. Namaste. Thank you. Namaste. Shalom. Uh -huh.